hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel um send you guys love like healing and blessings and i hope that you guys are having a wonderful wonderful day please like share comment and subscribe all right any information you need about me will be down in the description box below so guys we're going to get into a general collective reading and see what comes out for my youtube collective at this time so spirit messages do you have <coughs> The collective, all right. Yeah, two of pentacles in the reverse. All right, so somebody here could be feeling off balance. I'm hearing someone could feel as if um something is uh, not right, so someone could be trying to um fix something here with the eight of pentacles. They're putting in um some type of work or energy towards something, they're putting in effort. Um, possibly to bring back balance into a situation here yeah, because you have the five of pentacles here so someone could have took some sort of loss this could be you or somebody else collective or, or someone could be feeling left out in the cold here so the five of pentacles is definitely some sort of loss all right i don't know if you had some sort of exchange with somebody here all right, but i see the death card death card sticking all the flipped over also someone could be a scorpio I don't know, there could have been some sort of um, exchange that was supposed to be um, happening here. Let me see, what's the Six of Pentacles script? Yeah, Ace of Wands. So this could be pertaining to some sort of project. Um, let's see, this could be also something that you're going to be um, receiving with this Ace of Wands here. You could be receiving some sort of um, creative spark or something like that collective area was the ace of wands whether this is towards a project a person place thing to guys resonate yeah it's a sword so exactly <laughs> two aces here too so this is confirmation to somebody here that um you know things are going to be balanced oh all right you could be going through like a transformation also you yeah somebody here could be going through some sort of ascension here um mm. what's the ace of wands and the ace of swords <clears throat> what's the ace of swords great <laughs> sorry what the freak sorry <laughs> and the king of pentacles is here <clears throat> Alright, so there's some sort of truth about the King of Pentacles. Alright, that could be coming out. There could be something going on in court here with the Justice card. Someone could be um, connected to the Justice system in some way, shape, or form. Someone could be in um, some sort of position of power here. I'm picking up on someone could be wealthy. But somebody has a certain position here, possibly in society also. Let's see. What, what, what about this King of Pentacles? Yeah, this could be an Aries. Don't have to be. You have the full card here. Someone could be taking a leap of faith. All right, this could be you, collective. Masculine or feminine, take the messages as they resonate. Okay, all right. So, what's this fool? Ooh. Yeah, so someone could be taking a leap of faith here to create like a family situation, or they're taking steps towards uh, creating a family or creating something that will uh, you know fulfill them for like a very long time this is giving longevity so yeah whoever this king of pentacles is this could be you or somebody else, as i said this is someone that's um very responsible here all right someone could be um very from family oriented all right um let's see someone could be taking a trip to visit family all right or someone that they see as family let's see what's the full line ten of cups let's see what's the full line ten of cups spirit what's the full line ten of cups mm. Oh my god, alright, hold on. <laughs> These cards are acting funny all of a sudden, but okay. Let's see. What's this for? I'm gonna turn up cards. The 
Okay, when it's in a cut, yeah, the magician. All right, so this is something that somebody could be manifesting here, possibly by way of a visualization. So this King of Pentacles here could be a Taurus, Capricorn, or a Virgo. I'm picking up on heavy Taurus energy. All right, that someone could have Taurus heavily aspected in their chart. All right, someone could be a Scorpio, um, Gemini energy, Aries. All right. <clears throat> You could have this sign, sun, moon, rising, or Venus. But someone you could be like visualizing some sort of family situation with you. This person could be watching you online. Right, this person could want to call you, send you a text message or something of the sort. Alright. What's the magician on the ten of cups? The magician on the ten of cups. Five, five, five. Yeah, the emperor. Let's say no, the emperor. You. For some of y'all, right? It's either you are manifesting this emperor, this emperor is manifesting you, or both of y'all are manifesting each other. Okay? Heavy on the Aries energy. Heavy. This could be like a father, father figure of some sort. As I said, this person could be in a very high position here. Could be spiritually or in the earth realm, okay. But someone might be a little bit skeptic here with the nine of wands. All right, what's the magician and the emperor? <clears throat> someone is definitely in their power at this time, though. What's the magician and the emperor? Ooh. Listen, but some. Because I mean, this is your twin flame or your soulmate, your divine counterpart, alright? And this person, is it that they know that you're their divine counterpart? You could know this, they could know, alright? Yeah, this person could be watching you. We have somebody watching your home also. Yeah, somebody collecting, somebody's behind the scenes watching you like build something here, okay? And they could want to partner up with you. They could want to partner up with you, yeah, because I don't know if you experience some sort of missed opportunity here. Uh, but this whoever this person is, they want they want to come in and fill your cup. It's that this person just they want to like have you sitting pretty here, like you know, with the nine of cups here and behind that is a justice. So this person they are coming in to leave it to like leave they are coming in to get rid of the burdens that you've been carrying here, right? Yeah, this person is coming in to protect you and defend you, alright? This person sees you as their empress. Mm. That's for somebody. Let me tell you, the sun card with the ace of wands. The sun card with the eight of wands. I should say, this person has a crush, a, a liking to you, right? Someone could be a Leo. But there's going to be some confirmation here, alright? There's going to be a conversation also. There's going to be like, how are you going to know who this is? There's going to be like some sort of communication. They're going to communicate something to you or something is going to be um, communicated to you. This may even be some sort of um, download that you're going to receive. But it's giving clarity on a situation here for you, right? That yes, yeah, someone they do see you. They do see you. Let's see what's the sun on the eight of wands. This person could even want to come towards you, right? Travel towards you. What's the sun on the eight of wands? Yeah, but yeah, we have the ace of pentacles in the reverse here. 
So someone could be trying to block this new opportunity. And for somebody here, you may meet this person. I'm telling you, someone's trying to block this opportunity, right? Or block this blessing. Yeah, because something here is going to be long term. This may even be someone that you, you know, would grow old with or you're going to grow old with this person. Alright, with this eight of swords, it's given that this person don't see nobody but you, alright? You make it look like it's magic only. Cause I see nobody, nobody but you, you, you. I'm never confused. Hey, hey. I'm so used to being used. So I love when you call unexpected. Guys, forgive me, Mama. I'm kind. Of, I'm still a little bit stuffed with my sinus and everything. But yeah, I'm trying to sing this song. So I love when you call unexpected. Cause I hate when the moon is expected. So I'ma care for you, you, you. Mm. I'ma care for you, you, you. Hey. <laughs> Cause girl, you're perfect, alright? Mm. That's how this person could be feeling, but yeah. But someone's trying to block this opportunity. You may meet this, um person through i don't know it's through like some sort of work opportunity or something for some of you all right or a financial opportunity here what's the ace of pentacles in the reverse yeah all right page of cups ace of pentacles on the page of cups as i said yeah this person admires you listen Someone here could be a Virgo, alright? This person could be like, be looking into you and stuff with a Hermit card here. But they see you as their wish fulfillment. Yeah. Somebody has a serious crush or a liking to you, collective, whoever you are. But I want to see more on why the Ace of Pentacles is here, though. In the reverse. Yeah, because I'm thinking you have um, opposing forces here. You know this Ace of Pentacles? So I'm listening. Mm-mm. The Devil, the Eight of Cups, and the Four of Swords. There could be some sort of negative energy or, or a negative entity. And that could be trying to affect your mental, or your thoughts, your mind. Or someone, or something could be, or someone could be trying to manipulate you from walking away from whoever this person is. And because they want you to miss out on an opportunity. Someone's trying to get in your mind. Whether this is a man or a woman, take it as it resonates. So somebody's trying to get into your mind by way of some sort of communication. Alright, there could be um, someone that you may need to like hold back information from here. There's something that you should keep quiet and picking up on. Or someone could not want you to talk, so someone could be trying to cause you some sort of mental illness or some sort of physical illness here. Right? But this is being blocked and returned to the sender, okay? <clears throat> yeah, the chariot. Someone wants to come towards you. Someone could be a cancer. Yeah, someone wants to come to work because they're having a difficult time moving forward here. Someone could even want some sort of advice from you, alright? Yeah, because they're in two minds about something. What's the chariot and the six of swords in the reverse? Yeah, five of cups. They're also holding on to some sort of resentment, somebody here. I don't know, take the messages as a resident, guys, because, yeah.
What's this fellow, folks? Yeah, King of Wands. This could be a fire sign for some of y'all. Yeah, this could be a Leo. This could be somebody from your pit. Listen. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There is a fire sign. Could be a Leo from your past. I want to partner with you now. I reconcile. This person wants to make some sort of kind gesture towards you. They want to collaborate with you. They have good news. Yeah, but mm -mm. somebody might even try to rush you into something. But the Ten of Swords is here. Mm-mm. There's somebody here that you shouldn't trust collective. Could be a fair say. A Leo. Mmm. What's the king of wands? There is a Leo here. This person could be a part of some sort of group. Alright. Or they could be like involved with multiple females or something like that. Yeah. Look at this five of wands. Mmm. There's a lot of drama going on here. Here we have judgment. Um, someone could be called out for something here. Something, yeah, something gonna be exposed to the public here. Some sort of secret. For somebody here, this is also you like going viral. All right, for, this is a message for somebody. You could be going viral because of a gift that you have here. All right, a spiritual gift you had or have, I should say. Is giving you the upper hand, alright. Something you're gonna be on um social media or some sort of what's the judgment because uh, there could be also something about a, like a party, a celebration of some sort. Yeah, the nine of ones though and the ten of ones is here. Something is going to be um, announced or something like that is going to make somebody feel some type of way here with the nine of wands. Alright, because you could have battled through something here. Or someone could have judged you because you you were dealing with some sort of obstacles. Alright, possibly trauma here. I don't know, yeah, something could have caused you or somebody else to be a bit flighty and it caused <laughs> it caused someone to be flight flighty and you know with the two of swords here it caused them to be stuck not being able to make a like, they don't they can't make up their mind about something here. Is this king of wands? Is this king of wands? He as I say, he could be involved with multiple females here. He can't make up his mind about which one he wanna, you know. So you could be rejecting this person that you need to. So. Other than that, you have a king of pentacles. Someone who is loyal, trustworthy, faithful, coming towards you. Right? As to a sword. He just... Yeah, they could be also holding back, be holding back communication about something. Let me see what's this page of swords. Yeah, because you could have spoken some sort of truth here. You, you could have put your blocks up towards this person. Let me see what, what's the page of swords. Yeah, they're holding back something about them being like in a relationship or a connection with somebody here. Why my cards looked over like this? But yeah, they could be in a connection with that that air sign, possibly a Gemini or ear Aquarius Libra. What what's the page swords and the two of cups? Mm, yep, Aquarius. There could be some sort of living situation going on. This could be your twin flame, but someone here could have tried to trap somebody. Look, the ace, the Aquarius card and the three of swords is here, the star card, okay? Someone could be also healing, be healing some sort of heartbreak here. Could be an Aquarius. Someone is healing from some sort of betrayal, from some sort of entrapment. Hmm. Yeah. 
Someone could have tried to embarrass somebody here in public or something like that. To try to like gain the upper hand in a situation or to feel good about themselves. Yeah, but this ended up leading to um some sort of missed opportunity. Guys, take the message. This message could be all over the place or some y'all. But take the messages as it resonates, yeah. Because it could be multiple people watching. But yeah, the five oh one. Some sort of fight could have broke out here. And there could be some sort of argument or competition. Someone could be in competition with you. But it's like you're focused on yourself, Empress, Emperor, whoever you are, okay? You're focused on nurturing and growing yourself from what you have going on. I don't know who this person is. I, and as, as I said, take the messages as it resonates. Take it resonate, leave it down, but I'm picking up on different situations here. Alright, guys. Um, let's see. Same shit, different day. This king of wands. I hasn't changed one bit. They're still on the same shit. Whoever this boss daddy is. This is king of wands energy though. Same shit, different day. Some messages. Yeah, girl fight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Someone is trying to put you in the middle of a cat fight. Yeah. Mm -mm. Be careful. Right? There could be a female here. Wanting to be in some sort of fight competition with you. You have screenshot. Some of you are trying to get evidence or proof of something. But this fucking person, that's why they're stalking you. Whoever this person that is stalking you, looking you up, they're getting some sort of bad karma, y'all. And they're trying to cloud chase. They're cold hungry. And they're definitely talking shit about you. Bye. <laughs> also trying to like um do something with a photo a picture of you yes yeah, scarcity tactics someone's trying to have you um someone's trying to have you walking on like eggshells here I don't want you to feel like that paranoid. We have moving. Somebody here, you could be moving, you could be moving, or somebody else could be moving. Yeah, I'm telling you. Ooh. This stalker. Whoever this stalker is could be bankrupt, I right? that could be going bankrupt. Wants you back. I don't even have nothing to say, but we are moving on. Yeah, you're moving on, and this person is trying to cop block you by starting some drama over this spiritual hater is. Yeah, because they say that you're too busy winning. <laughs> yeah, karmic friends. You could be moving on from some sort of karmic friends. There could be karmic friends, could be females that are trying to be in competition or whatever this is with you. Oh look, we got quarter case. Something going on with that right deal. It ain't you though, collective. <laughs> it ain't you. Oh look. Cloud hungry. Someone's trying to get you caught up in something here. Amongst these women or that like they're screwing and doing or whatever this is, okay? Whoever this is, they have bad habits. They're, they're trying to get you like involved with drugs. Somebody could be trying to get you intoxicated to uh, do, do something. Okay, so just be mindful, guys. Yeah, and there's some other copies off of your already. Try to steal your energy, see the ideas, and whatever. 
I'm not gonna stay in this energy any longer, but yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys in another one. Toodles.